2011 Super Aeronautique 230 Team Edition. It is in thermal yellow, onyx black, and silver cloud as the hull. Uh, it's got uh, docking lights, underwater lights, tinted windows, Z5 Bimini, ta uh, Bimini uh, four tower speakers, spinner racks, um, the Chromax Super Air Nautique decal on the side has been painted black as long, along with the Nautique on the uh, stern. It's got underwater lights and we'll hopefully see them as we come around. Uh, very clean, one owner boat, fully serviced, ready to go. Inside this 230 team edition, we have uh, thermal yellow with black piping. Uh, we're going to walk from the transom all the way up through the bow and just check out all the features on this 230 team. Uh, it does have the transom remote, which is nice when you're hanging out in the water. You can change it without having people run up through the boat. Uh, nice center walkway with the uh, non skid uh, padding. Does have the option of the filler cushion for the walkway fits right down in have all have a nice pad to lay all the way across on easy storage connected has magnets about as simple as it gets it's got the upgraded ballast system which gives you about 2,500 pounds of ballast um, which is really really nice walk on through you have a uh, flip seat here so you can um, have a, have a pad all the way across the back bench or you can flip it, have a nice step through for all of your guests and, and everybody in your boat. Tons of storage in this in this 230. Seats flip up in the back for your uh, battery compartments. This side has your uh, igloo cooler, has an integrated um, charging system in it so if you do have a dead battery you can plug it right into um, a, an outlet. This side flips up, storage actually goes up underneath the uh, jam in seat here and all the way up through the bow. You can see here that we have the reversible uh, bench in already. It's an option on the 230, uh, which obviously this is optioned in. It's very simple. It's got two clips right here. Release them from underneath, pick it up, it stores in the back, stores all the way around. Very simple. Um, on the tower, we have the swivel board racks right here. Releases. Easier access to your wakeboards. Uh, you got four tower speakers, two on the inside that are swivel, um, two horn speakers on top. You got the ZR, or the, I'm sorry, the Z5 uh, Bimini. So it's a storage rack as long as a, as as well as a bimini. Um, coming on down inside, if you take a look at the uh, one of the custom things that we've done to this boat is put LED lights in the cup holders. They're yellow, kind of tie in the whole uh, scheme of the boat, color scheme of the boat. Come up to the helm, you see the throttle. We've put an aftermarket yellow uh, throttle knob on it. Same with the hydrogate shifter knob um, if you get down in here I'm going to drop the steering wheel a little bit so you can see keyless ignition belly port starboard ballast um, interior lights courtesy lights navigation lights everything's controlled through here you got the link screen which we're on the uh, speedometer page right now you got GPS music and then your zero off your GPS zero off system. Um, we also have heater and defroster on this boat. Um, and a 12 inch sub for the stereo system. Before we go forward, show you some of the other option or other storage that we have going on in here. You can see the trash can right here, which is also accessible. from the walkthrough. As you can see me fumbling around with, we have the walkthrough air dam as well, um, which is really nice, especially on these cooler winter days. 
valve filler cushion. One last thing to mention on this uh, 2011 230 Team Edition is that it's got the PCM ZR409. It's a 409 horsepower. Uh, it's been serviced by N3 Boatworks. It was bought by N3 Boatworks. Uh, and it's completely serviced and ready to go for another 50 hours. So.